left their London residence by car in the middle of his cancer treatment. Camilla, 76, smiled at viewers from the front passenger seat while Charles, 75, waved from behind. The royal couple were back in London after celebrating their 19th wedding anniversary in Scotland. Earlier this month, the king and his wife traveled to their Balmoral on the banks of the River Muick. The couple's anniversary retreat served as a much-needed break from recent turmoil within the royal family. In February, Buckingham Palace disclosed that Charles had been diagnosed with cancer following a procedure for an enlarged prostate. The palace stated in a release that Charles would be reducing his public commitments as he undergoes treatment. I would like to express my most heartfelt thanks for the many messages of support and good wishes I have received in recent days, the king said in a statement released by Buckingham Palace later that month. As all those who have been affected by cancer will know, such kind thoughts are the greatest comfort and encouragement. During his health struggles, Charles has limited his workload mainly to private audiences at the palace. His Majesty made a public appearance at the Royal's Easter Matin service in Windsor last month. While Charles prioritizes his health, other members of the royal family have taken on more responsibilities. Earlier this month, Charles enlisted the help of his younger brother Prince Edward and his wife, Duchess Sophie, for a changing of the guard ceremony at Buckingham Palace. Edward, 60, received a new title as a member of the esteemed Order of the Thistle while assuming greater responsibilities as a senior working royal. In addition to Charles, his daughter-in-law Princess Kate Middleton temporarily withdrew from public duties following her own announcement of a cancer diagnosis in March. As the two prominent royals take a step back from public engagements, Prince William has pulled more weight than usual. He's been covering for Kate, 42, and Charles during official events while also managing the household affairs of Prince George, 10, along with his younger siblings, Princess Charlotte, 8, and Prince Louis, 5, as their mother undergoes preventive chemotherapy. It's been stressful, a source exclusively told us weekly earlier this week. William feels a profound sense of duty to uphold the monarchy's stability and inspire confidence in the public that everything will be okay. It's a huge responsibility.